welcome to another episode of That's Amazing! We are continu continuing Transformers War for Cybertron. Yeah, that's the name of the game. I, I get the other one confused. And, yeah, so you got Squatch and Nick here. And, uh, Nick, he, it looks like you got a piece of paper. What does that piece of paper represent? It represents our word of the day. Thank Yay! You for asking. And what is that uh, word of the day? Um... Which one are we going with? Pew? Yep, Pew. P-E-W. -E yes. A long bench with a bag used as church furniture. Yeah, that's right. Because uh, I was wondering what that one was, and then I realized that's what it was. Alrighty. We've done the word of the day. We introduced the game. Oh, I have a new gun. Oh, good. Sweet. Yeah, I was getting sick of that grenade launcher one. So... Um, oh, I can aim, that's right. <laughs> oh, good! I wow. Was... <laughs> I'm sorry. Go ahead. Wait, 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 wait. Could you aim at the cannon, too? Hold on, I gotta reload. Yay! Wow, I feel like an idiot. <laughs> I'm sorry to anyone watching this game going, wow, you could have aimed that whole time, but whatever, now I know. Could have got a V8, dummy. <sighs> could have had a V8. I love a V8. I, I, I like the fruit V8. I don't like regular V8. Well, no, not the regular one, obviously. It's yep. the fruit one I try out, too. Because the, the vegetable V8 is just nasty, I think. <laughs> Alright, so last time on That's Amazing, we were talking about Tron, Tron and how cool Tron is. And the bridge. And the light. That's actually what started it. Like yep. the light bridge type of thing. <gasps> okay, so Cameron just walked in the room. Look out! With pizza. I'm... I, I worship you as a deity now, so, yes. Can you play a sound screen? Um, sound wave? Maybe? Sound wave, sorry. That's cool. I, oh, star scream, you, you mean, it's star scream and sound wave. So, um, yes, sound wave, I meant, yes. Uh, yes, okay. bye Cameron. Um, you can, I think, I believe you can. Oh, that's cool. I'm trying to remember, whoa, I'm trying to remember if... Um, Ravage is in this. Do you remember Ravage? Ravage? He was in the second Transformers movie. I only seen up to the second one. Ravage, okay, it's, he's okay. the uh, the old one. Wasn't he like the old Decepticon? But nope, he's um, well, he's uh, he's one of. Uh, if you're going by the old one, he's one of uh, Soundwave's cassette tapes. He turns into a a, a Black Panther. Oh, That's Ravage. He's yes. really cool. I do remember him. I even remember him in the old series, too. Yeah. Yes. Oh, do we go down? Oh, we go down from here. I think we're just like, let's shoot the fan. <laughs> so we don't die. It's getting hot in here. So take off all the fans. I'm telling you, man. Oh, is it some ammo? Alrighty. So, um... I was trying to think. I was actually going to mention something. Uh... What was that? More grenades? Oh, that's right. I have grenades, and I forgot about the grenades. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, you can see them. Okay, cool. Um, I am in a glitch. Breaking, I'm good. <laughs> breaking the game. Yeah, yeah. Uh-oh. Oh. I just transformed. Oh, God. Oh, that was our... Sorry if that's a bit disorienting. <laughs> Alrighty. There so... we go. Um... Oh, that's right, because we're going towards, like, the core of uh, Cybertron to find the dark... Energon cube? Uh, Energon, yes, thank you. Did you know that... Sorry to cut you off again. Um, did you know that the planet Cybertron is actually a giant transformer? Is it Unicron? It's Primus. Primus? Unicron is the other planet transformer. I... I'm glad you know of Unicron, though, because... That's very important. He supposedly uh, attributes to the new Transformers movie. Is he? Yeah, I'm, I'm not sure how much I how much I like that, but well, whatever. You know, Carl would have to show up sometime if you think about it. Yeah, I just you just can't go planet wide with like a freaking movie like that. You, I, that just seems too much for well for a real live movie. Exactly. I feel like Michael Bay could do it with explosions. <laughs> 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 no, seriously, I don't know. I have to wait to see the movie to have an opinion. Well. There are a few movies that can do outer space battles. But let's not forget Star Wars, Star Trek, Doctor Who. True. <laughs> this is very true. Um, anyway, sorry. Back to uh, Primus. Yeah. 
Um, actually, Unicron and Primus are rivals. That's um, Cybertron and Unicron are fighting, and that's what he was. Uh, Unicron in the movie was trying to get his revenge to Primus. I hate these guys. He's really? He's trying to get his revenge, and that's why he was trying to get. He was going to try to consume Primus. So is it going to be in the new movie? I don't know what's going on in the new movie. I just remember in the old animated movie, that's what happened. Oh, I didn't see the old animated oh, movie. Oh, you did I seen P I remember him in the, uh... Oh, the animated yeah, series? Yeah, the... The, the one of the newer ones. I think... No, it's um, the... Energon. No, it was the one with the little cars again. I don't oh, know oh, Armada. Armada, yes. Yeah, they did a whole Energon... Or, um, uh... It was... Yeah, because they built off of Armada and called it Transformers Energon. And I never watched that. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I sh probably should have paid attention. Um. Oh, I go this way. Okay. Good. You don't have to go out there in that dead tra death trap. I say that was a. Wait a minute. Or you probably do have to. Go oh out. great. <laughs> yep. I'm gonna have to. I say this broke open for a reason. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Here there we go. Oh. I'm gonna die. Why not? Let's, let's do this tactfully. Go. Oh, that was close. Yeah. So Primus, interesting concept. I think it's cool. Um, Transformers in general are really cool, but I, I, I don't know. I'm not really a huge fan of the movies. When I first saw the first Transformers movie, I was like, yeah, and then I realized that Shia LaBeouf is an annoying prick, so I wouldn't call him a prick, but an annoying person. <laughs> what, are, what are your views of the movies? Well, I haven't seen much Transformers, like I said back then, but, um... I kind of like. That was weird. It was kind of it was kind of interesting to me. Yeah. Like how they finally finally decided to make it a big movie after mm -hmm. all the years it's been out. I am such a hipster when it comes to stuff like that. When people are like, "Oh yeah, I like Transformers," I'm like, "Have you seen G1?" And they're like, "What's G1?" I'm like, what "Yeah, you think you can control stop." <laughs> no. And then like, no same thing for Star Trek. If they're like, "Oh yeah, I love Star Trek," I'm like, "How many movies have you seen?" And they're like, "Oh, just the, like two new ones." And they're like. Or, yeah, because they, they just they've only seen the two new Star Trek movies and they think that's all it is and I'm like I'm pretty sure you don't know because there are ten movies uh, other than the two new ones. So. Oh, what's that? Cameron, you threw off my mindset here. <laughs> it's he's got, okay. He's got pizza in front of us, people. Yeah, I'm just like pizza. I'm hungry. There's like look out. Pizza. Boss battle. Pizza. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's actually what my mind was doing. Like. Pizza? <laughs> no, it's. I think it just introduced the flying uh, Autobots, which you know, flying Autobots are quite rare because Decepticons have more flying. That, well, what about Jetfire? Jetfire is an Autobot, actually. Yeah, he's an Autobot. He's uh. Thanks for blowing up. He um he he can actually, if I'm correctly remembering Jetfire, he can actually um form with uh, Optimus Prime to, to make uh, someone or other. I don't remember. They're like freaking... Uh, there's so many Transformers. Yeah. Summer series. There, there's so many series. They, I was kind of getting sick of the new series that they were making. The um, Like I said, Energon and Prime. I never really watched Prime. I, I was kind of getting sick of it. Anyway. Iron the way across. I want to play Starscream. I like flying. Oh, damn it. I was right next to it. <laughs> <laughs> of course I was. Oh, jeez. Where's the... Oh. Oh, okay. Alrighty. Um, so you don't... Uh, so you haven't seen much of the... Because you, you, you mentioned you were going to watch the G1 series. Oh, uh, yeah. Or you wanted to. Yeah, well, I do. You I should. It's on Netflix, yeah, so I can I know. It's, totally it's, watch it. If it's on Netflix, I'm like, oh, I'm totally watching it. <laughs> Alright, so it looks like you gotta go over there, probably. <clears throat> or just watch what happens. Oh! Freaking I can aim again. I feel like Autobots- or I feel like tra Transformers can die easily. I mean, humans can die easily too, don't get me wrong. But... I don't know. It's just kind of weird. <laughs> well, that depends. If you're a tra if you were a regular person up against a Transformer, oh, then it wouldn't screwed. be... <laughs> <laughs> now, if you were a Transformer against a person, they'd be screwed. Well, it's the same, yeah. Whee! Well, yeah, in, but in this general way, then, yeah, it's easy to probably... It's probably easy to die, because they're all Transformers against Transformers. Yeah. 
I just imagine that would be easy. To, I don't know. Oh no, I you know I think I was thinking. Um, oh my. Uh, I was thinking of Tron again. How easily the programs can can die in that. Oh yeah. Or I think it's like that's interesting. Oh, they're like getting deleted. They're derezzing. Yeah. I remember that. We've talked about Tron so much. We've talked about Transformers so much. We've talked about Michael Bay so much. Michael Bay explosions. <laughs> oh my gosh. What's this? Oh, oh it's a new gun. Uh, was it more ammo? Oh, it's the same gun I have. Okay. Um. So, did you? Were you a part of the conversation we we're talking about uh, Star Fox 64? Uh, yes! Do you like Star Fox 64? I actually have it for the 3DS, yes. Oh, do you? Yes, I ha do. Have, did you play it, like, religiously as a child? I did Okay, I as did a child, too. too. Don't <laughs> worry, don't worry. I had an N64, and I got that game, too. Yeah, I know, because Peter's like, oh, I rented it. And I'm like, oh. Because I was playing with some friends last night. We were playing, uh, playing that, and I was, like, kicking their butts on multiplayer. I mean, one of my friends is doing really good, and then I was just, like, destroying Because I remembered how to play it, and they didn't. <laughs> so Best story ever, and I have a little bit of time to tell it. Here That's we fantastic. go. That's All right, go ahead. So, all, so, me and a couple of friends were playing a 3DS. I said... Hey, I have the Star Fox 64 to the 3DS, and if you guys don't have the game, that's fine. It's you fly on ships anyway. So here we go. Let's play the game. So we all play the game, and one of my friends is right behind. Like I've won all the rounds. Okay. And my I was right behind. My friend is right behind me. He's like, Oh yeah, I'm gonna get you now. So I flip my ship, oh, and he you, goes. You did the somersault. Yep. And oh, he goes. My you can flip? <laughs> I'm like, you had the game when you were a kid. How could you not? And also, I'm like, oh, it says in the back of the game case, too, that you can flip. Oh, my gosh. That is great. That's actually, that's funny that you mentioned that, because that's exactly what was going on. I kept beating everyone because they didn't know how to do the somersault. <laughs> or, the, or the turnaround. Oh, it's one of it these It was guys great. Here. That's the fantastic. The best part is, I mean, it's not an online, you can't play against other people online. No. You have to play locally. So we yeah. all had to be in a room. But the cool part was, even if you're not going to look at my face in person, there's like a little camera oh, thing on really? the screen. <laughs> so you're just like diabolically laughing while these guys are just <laughs> getting killed by you. That's fantastic. Yeah. <laughs> Um, speaking of Star Fox, the only thing I miss, or the only thing that, that I wish that game had in multiplayer was the ability to play as Wolf, Star Wolf. Yes. That would have been really cool. I mean, if you could play as all the Star Fox gang, or almost all, Yeah. then why can't you play Wolf team? Yeah, like his whole, I mean, even if you can't play in the main story, then why not in the multiplayer? Just change up the, the animation for the ship. I mean, that's all you have to do, but... <laughs> Whatever, maybe they just didn't they didn't think about it, maybe they weren't into it before. Oh, am I gonna make this? Yes, I am. I just I bounce off of someone. I don't know. But, um... Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna... I wanna um, play um, the main story of Star Fox on, on That's Amazing. Oh, um, de definitely. Definitely, I, yeah. I have the game, I just have to... So do I. <laughs> oh, well, we just gotta figure out how to plug it in, that's yeah, all. Yeah, exactly. And then... I also want to do a multiplayer of uh, Goldeneye. That would be a lot of fun. Uh, Goldeneye. James Bond, Goldeneye. Oh yeah, that yeah. game. Oh, crap. I didn't. Okay, I don't really have the game, but I played I at one it. of my friends' house, and <laughs> it's so derp. <laughs> we played a game last night where all we did was we had throwing knives, and this is an N64 game, so we had throwing knives and no auto aim. So when you throw the knife, it disappears. Like, you don't know where it's landing. So we were just, like, running into each other, throwing knives. It was, like, derpiest-looking thing ever. <laughs> oh, God. But, all right. So that will do it for yet another episode of Transformers on That's Amazing. We're going to keep fighting and talking about other things. I will try and stay focused on this game, but I got to tell you, all we're seeing is explosions and bad guys. Nothing to really talk Michael Bay! <laughs> Thank right, you. Hey, I mean, I don't blame you for just getting... Like concentrating on on the game of explosions because it's mesmerizing. Next time, uh, that's amazing.